Hey, Rich Nation, AJ Rich here. Rip Armin. We're watching season three, episode 18. Last time we had the death of Armin, the uh, crazy death of, uh, seemed like everybody, um, really, in that episode. Everybody was dying. Everybody be dying. Um, Levi showing full on skill on being able to make the Beast Titan look like like weak as fuck like that's the best way i can explain it like i levi just like shows his strength and completely kicked the crap out of him but he got away um but the biggest thing was arming sacrifice the episode was called hero he was a hero and uh you got it i just i appreciate his character and i'm still i literally just went from last episode of this episode so i'm still kind of re uh reeling from it but like it was just it, it was a beautiful episode one of my favorites so far like it's it's it was just such an amazing episode i talked about it in the ending of last episode so i'm not going to go too far into it but as is it was very good and this series it makes some absolute beautiful episodes but you guys like this this season this part has been amazing has been so good i i i i, I don't know how this series this series like change like completely pushes away from other shows and the way the storytelling and the writing is just done beautifully like so well i i i cannot explain how good this is the um but anyway if you're new to the channel please subscribe smash that like button uh check out my patreon patreon.com slash aj rich one two three for full reactions early releases check out the next two episodes on there and uh, go subscribe if you haven't subscribed and let's go ahead and start Ugh. The keep showing him. He's trying to get. Oh, fuck, I wasn't expecting this. Damn! Oh, he knew. Oh, he knew his dad. What? Brainwashed. God damn! Levi, holy shit. Wait. Rescue? Wait, he's just straight up leaving? Wait, he looks the... Wait, he's alive? What the fuck? Holy shit! Whoa! What? How the fuck? You're charcoal! How are you still alive? You're fucking charcoal! You're fucking coal! Uh, okay, Attack on Titan makes no sense. Oh, damn. Anji lost her eye. Damn. Shit. I don't think he's gonna talk. Damn! Oh, you could do it to Armin! If Armin's still alive, you could do it to. Holy fuck! That's true. You can't let your anger get to you as well. John's thinking rationally. Wait, so Levi's on the roof, bloody. With Aaron, that looks like the episode 12 ending scene. Oh God, how does it get to that? 
Oh yeah, she didn't even know. But you can do but you can do it though. You can use the syringe. Yes. What is he doing? Oh shit, he's still there. Holy fuck. God damn. He's still there. He's stay Oh, he's getting Reiner. Oh no. Ervin Dancho ga jousho desu. Hara ga egurete naizou made sonshou shiteiru. Oh. Shiga tsomarimasen. They're about to have to make a decision. No fucking wonder. No fucking wonder. Now, now episode 12, the ending, ending credits make sense. The ending credits make sense. You have to choose between Erwin and Armin. What the fuck are you doing to me, Attack on Titan? Of course he's gonna choose Armin. Of course Levi's gonna choose Erwin. Oh. This is a fucked up anime. No fucking wonder. The whole scene makes sense. All the puzzles. Of course it's gonna go this way. Why is Attack on Titan give us goddamn choices? Oh my god, I'm so glad there's a pause. Armin, Erwin, Armin, Erwin, Armin, Erwin, Armin, Erwin, Armin, Erwin. Who the fuck? It's it's not even like you can't fault. You can't fault either side on this because Levi insanely close to Erwin. Insanely close. Um Aaron insanely close to Armin. Like you can't you can't. Like of course Levi's going to do that. This isn't like one of those decisions. This isn't like one of those decisions where it's like, oh, you know, uh, you should do that, you know, the there's a chance, you know, you this is an actual decision. This is not an actual decision. Of course, the way these lives have progressed, Aaron's life, Levi's life, and their connections, they're going to go that way. Obviously, this is a fucking stalemate. And now we, oh my God, where is this going to go? Where is this going to go? <laughs> uh, injection conditions. Not only can Titan powers and much needed information be, and much needed information be stolen by using the injection, but it all, wait, not only can Titan powers and much needed information be stolen by using the injection, okay, but it also allows the revival of someone who is critically uh, wounded. Or yeah, someone that's who's cr critically wounded. Um, the ideal candidate would be someone near death that is already close to an incapacitated enemy. Wait, incapacitated. So like the, um, the, uh, the things that need to be like in place are really hard to find. You have to have someone that's di that's dying. You can revive somebody, uh, if that's someone that's dying, but they have to already be close to an incaps, uh, incap uh, yeah, in <laughs> incapacitated. Oh my God. I can't speak right now. Oh my god. I can incapacitated. Oh my god. I <laughs> If I don't cut that I you guys can think I'm an idiot. That's okay. <laughs> incapacitated. <laughs> oh man. Th that's crazy though. Like when you think about it, like the uh the the extent of this can be extreme. Like th the stipulations are just ridiculous when it comes to that. So where do you go from there? Like Aaron, Armin. I don't know. I I I, I don't know what they're gonna do here. It's this is this is insane. I I just need a breather. And there's the scene. Here's the scene. Holy shit! They just skipped that part. Shishou. 
still. There's no way he can. Think of it in his perspective. Damn. Oh, of course, Mikasa is going to attack. He is the reason. He did so much. He believes in Armin. Oh no, don't say anything to Mikasa. Not when she's like this. How do you choose? I had, I was pretty dang sure he had to. He deserves better. Oh. Is the bring back Erwin? Oh no, he's gonna. No. Now everyone's together. It's all gone to hell. It's all gone to fucking hell. They think Armin can do it too. They've been with them since they were kids. There's so many people that have died. So many people have saved them to get to that, to get as far as they have. Hanji got saved. Everyone dies in this goddamn anime. I don't think Aaron's gonna give it up. That's the pro <coughs> That's the problem. Of course they'd feel like that for your lifelong friend. He's pure. Yeah, they can't be around. They can't be around when this happens. God, that was a moment. <sighs> Fuck. This show. I couldn't even talk. We're fucking arming, man. But Erwin, Erwin is the one that, that can do it. He's the one that needs to lead them. But Armin is smart as fuck. What is he? What? What? What the fuck? He's unconscious, but... What do you do? You can't... You can't kill him! You can't let... You can't let him die! Fucking Armin! So he did get Armin! Bur uh, and fucking Berthold! Oh! Seeing it from the other side's fucking horrible! And Erwin, man. So he's never gonna get to the basement. What was everything for? He pushed for everything. So, Ar wait, so Armin's now the Colossal Titan. 
I'm glad he's alive, but fuck, it's one life for another. <laughs> Fucking beautiful. That's the closest, I think that's the closest I've been, I think that's the closest I've been to a tear in a show so far. I, I've been close a couple times on My Hero, but I felt, I actually felt something on that one. Holy fuck. Um, Erwin is an amazing character, and I, this show, like, you, you did it to Armin, yeah, last episode, and I thought Armin was completely dead, so I was, like, grieving that, and then you... And I mean, I thought Erwin was probably alive, but I didn't think it was going to be a choice, even though I should know it's attack on Titan. Of course, there's going to be fucking choices. The whole show's a fucking choice. Uh, but like, I really did not think they would. I really, I really did not think that they would go a route where it's Erwin or Armin. Like, I, I really didn't think it would go that way. I... I can't, I can't even, I can't believe it. I'm, I'm, I'm shocked. Like I, I'm, I, I, now the whole, that whole scene makes sense, but I, I can't believe they went that route. I, and I thought Irwin was awake and he was, you know, saying don't do it, but he wasn't actually doing that. He just, Levi, I guess just realized like, I, I was trying to grasp what it, like, it seemed like he just, he realized Erwin did things for a reason. He was he knew he was going to die there. He didn't he didn't expect that syringe for him. And that's that's what I get from that. It was like he was not he knew even if he doesn't get there, he did the absolute best he could do. He knew in that moment that somebody was going to move forward just like he someone was going to take his his resolve and his thing with Levi he could leave the rest to Levi that that's that's what I get from that I think he was leaving like he was completely ready to die and he was leaving and that's what Levi ended up coming up with that he was ready to die and he could leave it with him everything that he went for leave it to Levi I will say when I saw that scene on episode 12 uh, on the ending scene I thought Levi was gonna die in, in that scene that's what I thought that was my assumption I thought that must uh, something happened obviously but I thought he was gonna die um and uh I'm surprised because he's all bloody and and I like how they didn't put everything together there um they didn't like say everything when that scene played but man was the build-up worth it holy shit I I'm just shocked and that uh, that was the best episode best fucking episode last episode was amazing this this has got to be the best episode of attack on titan uh, fight me best episode but uh, i i i i the the amount of the amount of like emotion that went into that like for a good 5 minutes you know, you you guys know I fucking talk. I I I react and I talk. It got me to fucking shut up for like four minutes. Like I couldn't. I didn't want to fucking ruin it. Like I I could like I couldn't. As much as I can add on to something, I couldn't ruin. That's how much that emotion was just so much. I couldn't do it. I don't think there's been a scene like that. I I I. It was so beautiful, beautifully written. You put. It's just so, this whole anime is so beautifully driven, choices, choices, motherfucking choices, and it ends up with a real choice, Erwin or Armin. You have, you can, you can, uh, you can save one. It's just like, it's just a classic, it's like the classic question. If, uh, you know, if somebody's, uh, you know, so two people are dying, like, who do you save? Do you, you know, do you save the, the worker or do you say, you know, say or do you save the child or do you save the, the you know, you know what I mean? Like that type of question. Um, and I, they they put that here, which it's just. Oh, man, that was so beautiful. But to top it off, and I think it pulled me out of the moment for half a second was 
with Berthold, like he wakes up right when he's going to get eaten, like the worst time. And he knows he's going to die and it, everyone's watching him at, and he sees, I just, I, I look at it at his perspective. It's like all these people that were, I could have been with, or I was with, and they're all looking at me as like the bad guy. And they're glad that he's, that I'm dying. And it was just like, that hit me too. And that's why I was just like, I woke up from a dream. Uh, I woke up from a nightmare to another nightmare. That's what I think. That's I think that's what this show does in general. Yeah, uh, you know, here's more nightmares. Um, the uh, but they got but um, uh, the Beast Titan end up getting uh Reiner. So they they got he got Reiner. Reiner's still there and he's still there. So they're not out of the woods yet. Um, where they're gonna go from here, I don't know. Now Armin can fight. I, I I'm surprised. I wonder what um. Like, did he get more than that from the syringe? Because when I read that syringe thing, I read the the thing in the middle of the episode. It said something about um, some type of me- some type of memory thing or whatever. And when uh, we've seen Aaron see these flashes or whatever, is that is Armin getting that as well? Like when you inject, like does that happen as well? I don't I don't know. That's just the what it would seemed like when we when we read that, but. Um, I, I, it seems like you get other other stuff from that, um, but yeah, be, best episode. <laughs> fight, fight me. <laughs> no, like I, I Attack on Titan is really one of these shows that I I can't I, I I haven't been able to stop. I'll give you an example. I have not been able to. I have sat and watched all these episodes consecutively so far. I I was supposed to stop in like two episodes and I'm on six or you know what were we on six or seven or six or whatever what episode we're on of the part two um and I I just uh yeah I just I can't believe it I, it's it's crazy um the, the show is just amazing anyway guys I'm gonna stop ranting when I, I I'll, if I can think about more I'll say it in the intro of the next episode but uh thank you for watching please subscribe smash that like button uh, check out the Patreon, patreon.com slash AJRich123 for full reactions, early releases if you want to see the next two. Um, and uh, check out the uh, Twitter. Uh, go follow at AJRich123. Uh, and seriously, thank you for watching. This has a, been a beautiful journey. Absolutely beautiful. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.